I try to make work that speaks a common language, that has a kind of popular language that people understand, a visual language that doesn't intimidate them. Humor is a good way to get people in, you know, draw them into the work and have them think about it. 18 Young was actually our very first public art program for the Ontario Developments. The building happens to be at the very foot of Young Street, uh, where Young meets Lakeshore. Tom is quite famous for his whimsical, almost cartoon figures, larger than life, uh, sculpted out of bronze. His initial proposal to us was actually for these figures to be tourists in Toronto. And um, although um, we liked the idea, we saw a potential to make it a much more important concept. The immigrant family is such a classic story about coming into the new world, sort of looking up uh, with all your bags, and both this looking outward and looking inward, looking toward the, the baby, the future, and uh, being in this new country and looking out. I like this idea that Toronto was, you know, really a center for immigration into Canada. And I was touched that Mark Mandelbaum had this family history. My uh, in-laws uh, who arrived in the shores of Canada after the Holocaust uh, from Hungary, they and most of their uh, friends and acquaintances who came after the war actually landed in Halifax by boat and took a train across Canada. Their first look at Toronto was a train entering Toronto at that very spot. That um, image just struck a real chord with us. Toronto is ultimately a very multicultural city and although many people today come by uh, car or by plane or some other modes of uh, transport, in the early days most people came by train and their first view of Toronto was that very spot. I'm happy with it. I think it's a, it's a good purpose of public art that it sort of honors being a newcomer in the country and acknowledges it as an important role to play in the society.